send me a whisper, guys, if you would like to join. Uh, we're making a group. We're starting from Supremus, because that's where the boss we came to last time. And we'll go do it, okay? It might be in full experience, consumes ready. And it, guys, if you join, please make sure you're geared, okay? You're geared and you kind of know the strats a little bit, okay? But let's get some boys in here and we'll go it. Everybody is here except the one shaman. So we can just get everybody fully buffed up here and then we can start clearing the trash. And remember to give the tanks a few seconds for threat, obviously. Okay, boys, let's see how it goes, man. This guy gets pissed whenever his mates die. So we just need to make sure that he's not pissed, right? Uh, yeah. All right, so we clear up to Supremus, boys. And then we pump. Uh, we want to make sure we clear fully up on Supremus because... Uh, we pulled extra on the side. Uh, kill the uh, Wind Reavers first and then get on the other guys afterwards. Just pick up all the, the mobs and kill the two Drake boys first. Okay, nobody's doing what I said, that's fine. Okay, uh, it's okay, man. You know what? Uh, sometimes, boys, uh, it, it, it's actually like a good thing not to listen to the raid leader because uh, there's decisions that are better to do uh, that he doesn't know, right? So they, the raid is so good that they know that the call I made was not the best, so they decided to do their own thing, right? So it, it's actually, it, it just proves that this raid is like really, really good today. Okay, this looks very hectic. Like when you fit first into this place, it just looks so hectic, man. One, Let's go, boys. One. Last on pull, boys. Turn the boss around. Make sure the tanks are alive and blood blast and just pump. Okay. We just pump, boys. We just pump. You just got deathed. Did he over acro? No, he's like way below. B res Yuyashi, if we can. We have like four druids. He got a hateful strike, yeah. Okay, so we B res the, the paladin and we can keep pumping. Nice, nice, nice. Phase 2 will begin in 10 seconds. When phase 2 commences, guys, just run away from the boss and kite. Did I just dodge a, hate did I just dodge a hateful strike? I think I did. Okay, phase 2 will begin now. Yeah, so now we kite. Run away from the boss. Run away from the boss. If he's targeting you, run away. You can still DPS him, but just make sure you're far away. If he gets close to you, he probably will one-shot you. He will charge a person, but you won't die from it. We have plenty of room to kite, guys, okay? If you see, run towards the, the part of the room, but there's not like a lot of space. Run away from the vol volcanoes as well, guys. There's gonna be volcanoes all over the place. This phase lasts 30 more seconds. You can do DPS, but the, the important part is that you live here, okay? Okay, don't have to cut all the way. We, we preferably will want like to stay up here somewhere, if possible. Do we risk the biscuit, guys? We risk the biscuit. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna stay in. Melee can stay in if you got big balls. You might get one shot, though. Okay, we stay in, boys. We stay in. We just stay in and pump him, man. Supremus is gonna be an easy clap one shot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, we're climbing on the DPS meter as well a little bit, boys. Okay. We might just get one shot here, boys. We'll see. Okay. It's fine, man. Supremus, easy clap, boys. This is probably the hardest boss in the entirety of the raid. Nice, good job, guys. Super good, easy one shot. That's what it's all about. Good job, guys. Nice, let's rest people up and then we, we will continue here. So this is where it gets a little bit... Uh, I'm sure somebody can explain the strats a little bit better than I can here because... Uh, it's been a few years since I've been in here, but uh, I still have the strats and I can read them out and we can we can figure it out. So it should be fine. Basically, there is two phases. One of the, the first phase is we have to kill a bunch of mobs that like spawn and they run in towards the uh, the middle. We just gather up all the mobs and we kill them. We have like hunters put down frost traps and uh, just slow them out, slow them all down. Uh, obviously, militia is going to be like our big tank here because there's going to be a bunch of mobs. After the after that has happened, we will phase into phase two, where we will have all saved our cooldowns. And then the shade of Akama will go loose and he will go onto Akama. And we need to burst down the shade with bloodlust and all cooldowns. And we just need to burst him down before he kills Akama. If he kills Akama, then we wipe. So that's basically it. Phase one, bunch of trash mobs we gotta kill. Phase two, pop bloodlust, all cooldowns, kill Akama. Or like kill the shade. 
stack up all the rogues and the sorcerers together, and then we will just AoE them down. See if we can get some um, some traps down as well to slow them. Obviously, get out the fire. Yeah, we have some ads on the left again. They're gonna come now. Make sure we kill the ads before we go down the, ch the channelers again, guys. Just focus these down, and then we can keep killing the channelers. If we got some B-reses, you can use them on on someone if you see it. Okay, we get on Shade of a Kama now. So oh, pop all your cooldowns, pop Bloodlust, and we pump, we pump, we pump. Oh, he's dying so fast, man. Oh my god. Wait, this boss is literally free. Oh my god. Wow. Wait, was that it? What a joke of a boss. That was such a joke. Well, good job. Yeah, we pulled an extra pack. Uh, so like cleave everything down, man. I don't know what's happening. I'm stuck, man. I'm literally stuck right now. It's a 30 second route. Are you crazy? I am rooted for 30 seconds. Okay, well, I guess I'm, as long as I can reach stuff, then we're fine, I guess. Uh, focus the dogs, I think. I can't do anything. Look at me. My arms are too short. Yeah, do an empty if you can, because they, they root everybody. We got a boss now. I'm gonna quickly explain how I believe it works, and then you guys can add. I feel like you guys know a little bit more about it than I do, but basically, he's gonna inflict people with, like, a debuff, and then once that debuff runs out, uh, they will die and turn into a ghost. And the most important part about this boss is the actual people that turn into the ghosts, because if you do turn into a ghost, you need to go kill some shadowy constructs that spawn uh, in the corners over here. Like, way, way back here. So you, if you turn into a ghost, you get a new part of abilities, and you need to go and kill those shadowy constructs before they reach the raid. So, like, you, you have, like, three abilities. You have, like, an Ice Lance, you have, like, some Spirit Chains to, uh, to like, silence stuff, and some Spirit Volleys for AoE. And also, healers, you can cleanse the uh, the dots that is put onto people. And, um, yeah, so people, people die turn into ghost if you're a ghost you need to go and handle the ads that's that's basically it yeah i just want to debunk uh, that when you get the debuff the ghost spawns around you where you die when it runs out so that's why you have to run over here to okay uh, do because if you stand in a raid you're gonna spawn around you there Okay, right, so if, if you do get a debuff, um, make sure you run all the way like all the way back here so when you die you spawn those mobs and you kill the mobs I think we pulled. Okay, we pulled. Okay, we pulled. Go, 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 go. Okay, everybody, get, get him all the way in to the circle. Make sure the tanks are alive. So if you got that debuff, you need to go all the way back. It hasn't gone out yet. Okay, okay. Okay, so he died. Okay, I don't know what's happening right now. I've never ever done this boss before. I've only killed him in like retail. Yeah, Akro's a little bit off. Make sure you keep Otaku alive. Let, let's just keep going to see how it is, okay? Can we him? No. Let's... Yeah. Okay, so... He hits very hard on the tanks. It seems. Yeah, if you can soulstone someone who can rest, that'd be nice. I died. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Let's just wipe. Okay, so he, he hits very, very hard. So make sure that the tanks are topped off. The tank who's tanking it is like super, super topped off. Okay. Palm this little B word, man. Uh, I'm gonna hope I don't get the thing so I don't have to go do anything, right? So I can just like stand here and pump my damage. That would be preferred. But we'll have to see, I guess. Yeah, if you get the debuff, you need to move out when you're about to die with the thing, when it was about to run out, so you turn into a ghost. Okay, and then, you, then your job is to kill the mobs with the ghost thing. You did good with the thing, but just make sure the next person goes further back. Whoever did it in oh. the back is doing good now. Like, you're doing super, super good with that. After you kill your stuff, you can shield the tank, you can do something. I'm bopped! I'm bopped! I'm bopped! I was trying to do damage, but I was bopped! If, you, you, if your spirit, go all the way back. All the way back and handle them all, all the way back there. Dude, I literally got bopped, man! Was it, the, was it the red paladin who did it? That's the only person I could think would do that. Easy clap. Don't pop me, boys, okay? Do not pop me. Why am I... Okay, I swear to God, every single time I pop Rick, I just start missing everything. It's it's like, always happens, man. It's so bad. Well, easy clap, boys. We didn't one-shot it. But we did two-shot it, okay? 
And that's actually pretty freaking decent at the end of the day. Oh, right, easy two shot, boys. One shot the second time. Nice. Good job, guys. Very good job with the ghost as well. Super nice. Nice! Throne and some insidious bracers. These are actually not bad. Remember the first phase with the first one? We have the tank swap the, uh, the threat or like the aggro because you can't heal. Alright, guys, let's go. Let's go. We're going. We're going. Everybody move together, together, together. So we don't pull any mobs. Make sure you bring your totems too. Good, good, good. Everybody, everybody can, the boss. all casters can stack here somewhere. It's fine. Casters okay, boys, let's go. Around the totem. We live, we live where we have Ghost souls. Tanks, remember? Pain and suffering are all that await you. Remember, there's no healings. You can't heal here. Okay. So, melee is to take a further step back. As far back as you can if you're not tanking. Yeah, max range it. That's melee. Okay. When do we have the next one? Soul Drain in 15 we're, seconds. We're I assume that's when we swap. In. Okay, so we need to swap soon. Step back, warrior in. Yeah, he okay, there it is. A, nice. It, it's a timer, so it takes some time sometimes. And Rage, awesome. Rogue in, Evasion, in the middle, in the middle. Nice. Okay, okay, I have no idea what's happening right now. And out. Wait, no, so we kill this guy completely and then we go to the next phase. Oh, wait, so we kill one phase and then we go to the next one. I get it. Yeah, just keep going, just keep going. Oh, I thought we had to like swap. Oh, so we kill one and then it is the next phase. Okay, so now it's the next phase. Oh, that makes sense. I've never done this, guys, so like. Uh, get a B-Res on Gusafan as well, if we can. Everybody rest up here so we can keep going. Get a good attempt. Oh, I thought it, it like it, I thought it was like one health bar and like he swapped. I didn't think you kill, killed one completely and then it like. Okay, that, I, I misunderstood the boss then. It's my first time really doing this boss ever, so uh, we need to kick that guys. Make sure you kick those. Kick all, kick all the spells basically. Kick, kick, kick. Good job. I get next. I don't have rage. <laughs> okay, pump the boss, pump the boss. Yikes! No! Dude, that was so smooth too! So smooth! That was a really good attempt though. Um, yeah, we might want to just use uh, Lost for like phase two, I guess. Super good actually, like this is a lot smoother, dude. Need one more kick now before it dies, guys. Make sure to kick it. Alright, super good, guys. Very smooth. We stack up again. A lot cleaner. That was way, way, way better. So we're gonna pop Bloodlust at the beginning of this phase, guys. We need to empty onto the tank, misdirect, and then we pop Bloodlust, all cooldowns, and we pump the boss. Wait Just make sure you don't overacro. The, 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 there is an increased threat table the first 5 to 10 seconds. After that, I'll pop Bloodlust. Okay, but so, yeah. both MDs during this phase, so the tank has as much threat as Okay, so just wait with Bloodlust until 10 seconds. I'll, I'll call it. Just don't Bloodlust until I say. Bloodlust, and then go. Pump, 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 pump. Everything, boys, let's go. Spite on you, what's that? Immune to all damage. Okay. Yes, okay, bomb, let's bomb. Break as well. Just blast, 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 blast. Oh my god, dude, I am blasting out. Of 
And I hope you're ready with the. Uh... Oh, okay. <laughs> Are you kidding me, man? Come on, I'm the only one who died, man. Come on, dude. That execute at the end was like 9.6k. That was hot. Good, good job, guys. No casualties. Okay, I have never done this boss, but I will read aloud the uh, strats for us, and then we can talk about it. So, phase one lasts for 60 seconds. We will have groups rotating for an ability called Blood Boil, which targets the players that are furthest away to their, for their blood to, to boil, and they take damage uh, every second for 24 seconds. So we need the three range groups, um, which is four, five, and three, to do that. And we need to alternate the tanks after he casts an ability called Bewildering Strikes. Phase 2 begins after um, he uses his 5th Blood Boil. Uh, he will then gain an ability called Fill Rage, and another player will also gain that ability called Fill Rage. This player will then be able, will, will, will then be the tank, basically, and they must phase uh, the boss away from the raid to not get hit by a AoE cone, like a breath. Range needs to make sure that in phase 2 you stay far away to get not get hit by Geyser, and then there's no threat in this phase, so when phase 2 hits, we will pop Bloodlust. So save cooldowns for phase 2. I, I can show this here, you see the paladin. So the entire raid doesn't stand in the water. And when you it's your group's time to take it, you just step back. And you keep casting because the boss is going to be on the other side of the other waterfall. You get the blood boil and then you step back up. And then it's the other group's turn to go down. Take it and then you go up. Yeah, so it's, it's group 3, 4, 5. Okay, so group 3, you guys are going to start out here. Once Blood Barrel is cast, you guys move into the raid, and then group 4 you move out. And then group 4 goes in, group 5 goes out. Group 5 goes in, group 3 goes out. Okay? It's gonna happen 5 times. Blood Barrel in 5 seconds. Blood Barrel happened, so you move in, and now group 4 moves out. Thanks, be ready to push threat on me. Group 4 goes in, 5 goes out. Yeah, you need to take it over soon. I'm gonna stop here. 3 go back out, and f uh, 5 goes in. You need to take it over. 3 goes in, 4 goes out. We're gonna transition soon. Yeah, he died, he died. See if we can keep going here. Okay, so now we transition. Okay, you're the tank. Tarambo, you're the tank. Get to the tank spot. You need... You, no, no, don't bop him. He's the tank. He's the tank. You need to go to where the tank spot was before. Move him away from the raid. You are the tank. You you turn into the tank when you get fell rage. All right, so... Yeah, so now you're tanking, basically. You 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 become the tank, and now we kill the boss. Um... Yeah, so wh whoever gets fill rushed, fill rage, whatever, turns into the tank and needs to tank the boss away. Um, so that's basically why you, you need to move him over right, a little bit faster. You, you just are still in the in the raid, but you, whenever you get fill rush, you become like massive, super huge. Turn the boss away from the raid and go to where the tank was tanking before. Group three is out for blood boil. Go in, group four out. Okay. Go in, group five out. Go in, group three out. Go in, group 4 out. Go in, group 5 out. Okay, we, we go, we go, okay. Kintudo, you need to go to where the tank was. Go to where the tank oh, just, was. Just stand still, stand still. Everybody move away, move behind the boss. Behind the boss. Don't be in front of the boss. Not lost if you have Not lost now, and we pump. 
tank save your cooldowns for when he gets up. Five if you got seconds. any defensive Kim Tutu, you need to pop them. Massive heals on Kim Tutu, guys. He's the tank right now. Okay, JQ now. Heal JQ, guys. Heal JQ. It's not last before. Okay, group three out. Group three out. JQ stop doing threat. Group three in, group four out. The same as before, guys. We swap between those two phases. And next fail rate is. If you can. Group four out, group five. Uh, group four in, group four out. Group five out, sorry. English. Uh, tank died. Okay, group five out, group three out. Uh, group five in, group three out. Group 3 in, group 4 out. Bell rage soon. Just keep going, guys. Okay, out. Group 5 out. Okay. Hell Flames is now the tank. Hell Flames big. Baba Hell Flames. Bop, 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 bop. Good. Pump. Be res, restore if we can. Big heals on Hell Flames, guys. He's the tank. If you got any uh, like defensives, pop them. You can block even. Block, block, block. If you want to block, 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 it's fine. If you want to. If you want to live, block now. Block. If you want to live, okay. Big heals dead. Otaku, big heals no Otaku, guys. Okay, group three out. Group three out. Miss Blood Brawl, guys. Blood Brawl. Group three Watch out. Watch your threat. Watch your threat. Yushashi. Go in. Group four, go out. Go in, group 5 out. Go in, group 3 out. Just keep going, guys, keep going. Fell rage in 5 seconds. Go in, group 4 out. Fell rage in 2 seconds. Bell Rage now, new tank is gonna come. Start when it when the tank comes out, you need to pop that guy. Bob Pally, Bob Pally ho ho. Bob him, bop him, bop him. Turn away from the boss if you're if you're need to be behind him and just uh, pump him now. Make sure Pally Ho is just topped off. Just spam heal him. It lasts 17 more seconds. He will be tanking for 17 seconds. We can kill it now. You have... Yeah, pop 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 cooldowns, everything now, just pump. We win. Easy clap boy, second try! Yes, dude, let's go! Lay on hands on yourself. <sighs> Super good, guys. Second try, that's really clean. Good job, boys. Yes, dude, let's go! Nice! That's clean. That's a clean raid. Let's go! Really, really good, guys. Uh, good job listening to the calls and everything. You guys did really, really well. Now we got the, the, big, uh, the big mommy boss. All right, I'm just gonna go over real fast then what it is. So like we have all the ranged where the ranged are standing and the melee under the the thing where all the melees are standing basically. Um, she will target the tanks with Saber Slash, which is just like damage. And then the most important thing about this boss fight, I assume, is the fatal attraction. If you get targeted by this, you need to run away from the raid because you will like you need to run away from the people that also gets afflicted by it because you have some chains, right? So if you get fatal attraction, you need to run away from the people who also has it. So you need to like spread out when you run that when you get that debuff. And then she'll also cast some beams, which we can avoid. Uh, the beams can't really be avoided. She'll just cast beams on everybody. I mean, unless people have thorn wing sleeves, but I doubt people in this raid are gonna have thorn wing sleeves. But you can take that back to your guilds whatever you want. You can. They do soak up beams um but yeah the fatal attraction will teleport three random people it does not teleport tanks but it teleports three random people uh you'll get teleported here and then who's that adjective where are you stand with me so we can show them how it goes uh where are you at sorry yeah moon so like me yuzu adjective we'll go ahead and be here we'll get teleported and then you have to immediately run in a separate direction not towards the raid and then oh. 30 yards breaks it if you get towards the raid it'll start hitting everybody in the raid Okay. So you do not run to the raid. <laughs> okay. That's not yeah. good. Yeah. If, if you get, <laughs> there is a very small RNG chance that we get people get teleported to where the raid is at or near it. That's just you know luck of the draw, yeah. which sucks. 
Um, but yeah. if it, if you are, if it's either you run to the raid or you die, you die. Okay. Because if well, you get to the raid, you're gonna die. You're gonna kill the raid. I, I, I say we give it a shot, guys. I uh, I say we just try it and then see how the boss works. Because I, I feel like that's usually the best way of figuring it out. So sure. melee stack onto the thing. Uh, range are where you are right now. If you get fatal attraction with the teleport, you run in three opposite directions, not towards the raid, and then that's it. Basically. Yeah, she slaps tanks, guys. Kills. Yeah. Yes. Big heals in the tanks, yeah, as always. Set her up. Focus the heals in the tanks. Get her positioned. That was perfect. Okay, give him a few yeah. seconds. And we can lust. And pop big, big stuff. Lust. Rate of silence. Yeah, we're silenced right now. Lust. He's silenced right now. Uh, you, you can, can si just lost now, lost now. Everybody lost, 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 lost. Run away, guys. Yeah, if you get teleported, you need to run away from each other. Yeah. I can't see what's happening. I'm like behind the. No, 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 we did. We got it. We got it. Uh, okay, if you get teleported, just run away from each other, but not into the raid. Okay? Yep. And th that's basically it, guys. This is the fight. I think. Yeah, that's pretty much it. That's easy. It's the fatal attraction. That'd be nasty. Dude, she's so easy. Yeah. Watch out for the fatal attraction, guys. When you get teleported, run away from each other, but not into the raid. That's literally it. Buff my pet Nirvana, away from each other, not into the raid. Good job, good job, guys. Uh, we can B res Yuashi if possible. Raid silenced, raid silenced. We can B res Yuashi after the silence if possible. We have lots of druids, so just get the B res out. Is there any innovates? Innovates, what? Innovate on spider if possible. Fatal attraction, run away from each other, away from each other, not into the raid, away from each other, but not into the raid. Guys, if you if we have B resses, just throw the B resses out, okay? We're giving you one good attempt here. Come on. Uh, bloom, bloom, mid raid action, please. Or action. Okay, just keep plumping here. We're 50%, man. We can do this. Damn it! God damn it! Alright, okay, just keep it up, guys. Keep it up. This this way we have better a view of the raid. We can do it. We can still do it. We have plenty of people alive still. 39%. I should have shadow rest parted. Oh my god, I'm griefing. Sorry, yeah, guys. It, the, the problem when you're raiding, run away from each other. You can cloak if you can. Good, good job, guys. Inky Pussy died. That's fine. I'm, the, the problem when you're raiding is you're so focused on the thing. If we got a B-Res for Militia, Someone please do so. Somebody has to soak, yeah, for the tank. Like a beefy melee, go into the tank and soak. If you have evasion, Gusu. Yeah, Thank you for your work. patronage! Okay, wait. Dead again. Gusu juice are dead again. Gusu yeah. juice are dead again. Just keep it up, keep it up. Fatal attraction is going to happen again soon. Just get ready for that. Be ready with your Shadow Rest pots uh, and, and like uh, Hillstones if you get teleported with the uh, attraction. Oh my god, stop! Dude, I'm literally tilting. Stop, 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 stop. Get ready for the teleport, guys. Get ready for the teleport. Okay, run away. Shadow prods, shadow prods, and like healing potions, guys. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. All consumables, guys. Like, just burn this face. Now, if you can burn her down, we can, we can still kill it. 19%. Really, really good first try here. Get ready, if you get Shadow Attraction, guys, key bind your Hellstone, Healing Potion, or your Shadow Press, Shadow Pod right now. If you get, if you get Teleport, just insta-pop it. Easy go. Easy go. We will kill it, we will kill the first try. Enjoying yourselves. Heal that, heal the tank. He kills in the tanks, guys. Heal the tank. Yeah, focus the tanks. Really good, guys. Good job, good job. Keep your Zerg. Now massive heals in the tanks. Let's make sure that they stay alive, guys. We have 8% left. We've got like plenty of people alive. If you get fatal attraction, so it can happen any time now. Just pop your pop your potions for that. Pop your uh, consumables. 
We're getting the good POV, guys, okay? We're using zero resist gear. I'm not impressed. Okay, pop consumables. Potions, Tauron Boon. That potion safety right there, that was good. Good job. I would say this is a pretty good first attempt, guys. Yeah, just keep it up. Gonna be, this is gonna be a uh, kill. Just keep yeah, going. Five, five more percent. Just keep it up and we can, we can kill it first try. Good kill this time. Okay. I could be ready to shield wall if. Yeah, you could. Yeah, Whenever. pop the uh, pop wall if you can. Just make sure we get the kill here. We can do it. Just kill it. Just kill it. Yeah, just burn We're it down. Good. Dude, super good job, guys. First super try. Nice job. Nice. What? Shadow res and paying attention to the fatal attraction. That's the biggest thing. We Trump literally a... didn't use shadow res. That's such a good job, guys. No, I think a lot of people got Shadow Res. No, we didn't use Shadow Res, dude. That was so good. No Shadow Res. I, I, oh, I, I, 250, so yeah. I, I, I put on 200 for that, but yeah, yeah, day, day one, you're not going to have any Shadow Res, yeah. and you're going to have to spam dude. engineering boots with the macro. That's a nice chest, no, by no, the way. I don't greens. know if that's better, though. The oh, green, yeah, better. There's no Stam, really, in the greens and stuff. Oh, there's tons. Tons. Or not Stam, uh, like, healing, healing, like intellect and healing power and shit. And so it's, it's, it's not as good, but um, yeah, for sure. I, I, I think a lot of people had to go now. I, I, I know I stretched it a little bit with a lot of people with the uh, mother as well, but we got the first try. But if you have to go, it's completely okay. Just uh, thanks for coming, though. I appreciate it very, very much, guys. It was very fun. We, we spent like two and a half hours or so. And we got all the way up to like council. So that's awesome.